What is up, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls? This is Jeff Benjamin with iDownload Blog. Going to show you how to downgrade from iOS 8, which I am running here, back to iOS 7.1.2. Now, obviously, your device will need to be capable of running iOS 7.1.2, so the iPhone 6 and the 6 Plus are not, are not applicable in this case here. What you also want to do is go to the iCloud settings, make sure Find My iPhone is set to off so that you can restore your device. And once you do that, you're ready to go. So I have my iPhone 5S here running iOS 8. What I'm going to do now is I'm going to head over to iDownload Blog's website. And there is a downloads page that you're going to want to go to. It's, at, it's in the link at the top of the page. You see download there. And you just want to scroll on this page and find your firmware download for your device. So in my case, I have the iPhone 5S GSM. I'm going to download iOS 7.1.2 for it. And you can see it right now on my desktop right here in the background right here. So now what you need to do is you need to hold the Alt key on your keyboard and then click Restore iPhone, select the firmware, click Open, and then once you read that little message here just telling you everything will be erased, etc., click the Restore button. And that's what I'm doing now. So from there, it's pretty much just smooth sailing. Now, there is one caveat that you have to consider. And you can see my iPhone's restoring there right as we speak. You will need to do this before Apple stops signing iOS 7.1.2. So if you have any desire whatsoever to downgrade your device to 7.1.2, whatever the reason may be, perhaps you want to use jailbreak tweaks or things like that, it doesn't matter. But if you have any desire to do so, you will need to do so fast because Apple historically closes the signing window for older firmware in a fairly fast fashion. So you want to make sure you downgrade now, today. Don't wait until tomorrow uh, if you have any desire to downgrade because once they close the signing window for iOS 7.1.2, that's a wrap. You're stuck on iOS 8 and there is no going back. So hope this was able to help you out. I have downgraded as you see here. I'm running iOS 7 right now on my 5S. It's that simple, ladies and gentlemen. Let me know what you guys think down below in the comments. This is Jeff with iDownload Blog.